um, where there's so many contacts from coach, from also my friend from here, so I don't want to say a name because he's sometimes complicated in Armenia. But we, they asked me what is my condition about my former team, Aragat Armenia. So I told them everything is finished and after a few days, so we had a talk about transfer, if I want to be here or no, and then we speak. I tell them my terms and they told me also what they are looking for and I'm here, everything is okay. Yeah, when I met with the coach, you know, he told me his philosophy, you know, what he wants and he saw me like a player who can fit in to his philosophy and he wants to work with me and, you know, it's not going to be easy. There will be so many challenges also, but you know, he knows I can fit in in the philosophy and he told me what he wants and what I need to do also, which is normal and I'm sure we just start training, so with time, I'm sure we will work together and everything will be fine, so. Yeah, I think, yeah, when I was with Arat Armenia, I had one or two times interview with the I forget his name, V Media. Yeah. So, you know, I told him, you know, with time, everything always change. People put interest. Before, you know, not everybody liked football. Before it was so so. But now everybody is putting so much interest. You know, what I told him about Armenian League, if you check like two years ago, it's different. And now there's so much competition in the game, so many players from outside, even the Armenian players, they are, you know, they are coming stronger now because there's so much competition for them to learn. And for we also, outside, you know, we have so much to give and we have so much to learn also. And the only thing I, I said is, the Armenian League need so much progress, you know. Like, if I have to talk, I have to talk about Austria, you know, this is where I come from. There are something called, TV rights, you know, there's program for the TV, for the league, they advertise it more, they give more support, they bring so much sponsor in so many games outside. I think, you know, the Armenia needs to do more of this, so much broadcasting, so much sponsor to come in the game so that, you know, when somebody from, let's say, from England acts like, oh, this Armenia, you know, they have to have the idea that, ah, there's so much broadcast, there's so much sponsor also, so that it will not be like, where is Armenia? What's happening? So, you know, you need something like that also to improve. I said this, but, you know, it's not my own to do. It's just, you know, idea. So the federation, the teams, they have to work together because it's progress for, for the country and for everybody, not just individual. Anything that comes into Armenia is benefit for the federation, benefit for the team. So I think if they work together, maybe there will be more progress for the league. It's just my own idea. <laughs> yeah, you know, first every player is always happy to be in the Champions League, to be in the Europa League, no matter maybe from first round, or it doesn't matter, you know. The goal is to make sure you play with teams in the top top international game. You know, the goal is when we're going to start, you know, everything in life is step by step. So I think with the Champions League qualification, the starting of the games will determine how the team wants to go. And to reach a bigger level, it started from training also. So I'm sure by the time training starts, everybody's ready. The goals will open more, but the goal is to you know go further than what we have been doing before or what Alaska has last season. You know, the best way for Punic opportunity now is to do better than Alaska. So I'm sure the goal is to go far. In Champions League or Europa League doesn't matter. The goals have to be higher than what the other team do last year. So that's my goal for the team to go further, better, and bring more more memory to the team. Uh, I choose number 14, 14, because um, 14 have always been my lucky number. 
I choose that as a lucky number because you know when I start looking at football I always look into Thierry Henry with the 14 guessing number you know he inspires me so much you know it's not a striker alone who only wants to score goal you know he knows how to play football he knows how to do one or two things so from there I choose any number with four as lucky number and that is why I go for 14. To the fans of Punic, um, I know in Armenia there's always a little confusion about teams, players, coach, everything here. But you know, where you are, where I am now is my family. So I'm here, you know, to play for the team and to have the support of the fans and everyone who loves Punic. So I am here. And I want the support 100% and for the team and for everyone. And I'm sure with that, we will be happy at the end of the season. Thank you.